Nestled between the trees in the BYU Museum of Art Sculpture Garden stands this eye-catching bright orange sculpture. This artwork titled Buck by Michael Whiting was created for a 2007 exhibition, Walk in the Park, at Plus Gallery in Colorado. It was only a few years later when the BYU Museum of Art hosted another exhibition of his work called Michael Whiting, A Bit Modern, in which Buck was not only included in the show, but purchased by the museum. Created in a way to resemble pixelated and simplified forms, Buck represents Whiting's interest in both minimalism and video games. The artist explained that this fascination actually came from an experience of mistaken identity. Piet Mondrian's Broadway and Boogie Woogie is a modernist work created in 1943 that emphasizes clean vertical and horizontal lines, as well as a limited color palette. However, when Whiting experienced this painting, he mistook it as something produced in the 80s and influenced by then-current video game images. Due to the lack of visual storage available on computers at this time, video games had to simplify their illustrations as much as possible while still retaining important and recognizable details. It was after this incident that Whiting decided to take on the same challenge of creating unmistakable objects that resemble blocky images. As you walk around Buck, you can see the different combinations of geometric shapes that make up the deer's form, which includes recognizable antlers, tail, and legs. But how exactly did Whiting decide to simplify the form the way he did? It might be surprising, but the artist actually researched knitting patterns of deer commonly found in holiday sweaters. By looking at the stitches used, he followed the same basic design. Now take a look at the paint job itself. Up close you can see that the orange coloring is a little beaten up and you might conclude that this wear is due to Buck's life spent outside. However, even before Buck made its debut in the garden of the Plus Gallery, Whiting took rocks, sandpaper, and even cinder blocks to the surface of the sculpture with the intention of creating a distressed look. As described by the artist, the purpose of this treatment was to give the sculpture a sense of history. Whether you are experiencing this work when the sun is high and the trees cast shadows across its body, or whether the snow has draped the deer in white, Buck is a hidden gem for all campus visitors who take the time to notice and appreciate his amusing grandeur.